Hi, how you doing? And today I'm going to show you how to insert into a table from a select statement. Really, really easy. It's a nice, short, simple tutorial for you. you. You won't need anything. If you haven't got SQL Server installed, I'll link to my tutorial on how to grab SQL Server and everything you need for that. It's nice and quick and easy. And just enjoy the tutorial. If you've got any requests, suggestions or feedback, comments below and subscribe for me and come make my day. Enjoy the tutorial. So I'm gonna show you how to insert into a table using a select statement. Now to do this, we're gonna use AdventureWorks 2019. And the table I'm gonna use is this log table here. And to do that, I'm just gonna create a replica of the table, but it'll be version two. So I've changed the table name. I've changed the primary key. And I'm just gonna create that. Now to do that, I can right click on the table, can script it, create it. I'll get rid of these extended properties because they're not essential in this case. I'll change that there and I'll change that there. So that's how I'm creating that table. So I'll run that in. So then if we go down to here, we can look at what's within our log table. We can see there's several, there's 1,596 rows in here. So we're gonna filter that down by schema. And we can see we've got 97 rows filtered by this column here. If we scroll down to our new table, it's exactly the same structure, but it's empty. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna run this initial query here, but instead of this ID column here, I'm gonna select here each of those tables. So all these, so each column here, I'm gonna select and run it like this. If I can select it. Now the reason I'm not selecting my ID column is because that is my primary key. And when I insert that into this version two table, the primary key is gonna be auto-created. So what this select statement here is showing is what I want to insert into the next table. And the primary key column will auto-create. So I run that. And I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna, and I'm gonna put it just within, just within here, underneath an insert, and I'll run and insert that into it. I'll say 97 rows completed. Can select here. And we can see that that table is now populated. Now the only issue here is this time here from the original table that we've inserted into our version two table is slightly out of date. So I might wanna take this original select statement and I might want to change the value of it here. So let's run this query without the insert. We'll do that here, sorry, let's run that without changing it. We can see it's 2017. If I change this to get date, I can run that, and that'll give us the exact time that we want. So that's more reflective of the time we're inserting into our table. So let's truncate this. We can see that we've got a nice empty table run back and insert and we've got the 97 rows with a more up-to-date post time column. Now the other thing we may have, let's truncate this table again, is that I might not want to insert into the schema column. I may, I may want to ignore I may want to ignore this. So if I look over here, I can see that here at the end, it's allowed blanks. Because we've got up here, it's not, and here it is. So I know that I can leave that blank if I wanted. So up here, I'm gonna do my standard insert, and I'm gonna specify what columns I'm gonna insert into. I'm gonna remove that. I'm just going to insert into them here like this. Run up here. 
I'm on my version 2 table and we can see the schema is null. Alternatively, another way we can do that is if we removed this, we can change the value just as we were earlier and to specify it as a blank. Do a select. We can see it's blank there. A nice simple ways of inserting into a table from a select statement. You can also obviously just select here and you could change this schema to be whatever you wanted. And you might want to change the schema here to reflect that. But these are all simple ways which are used to insert, to insert into a table from a select statement.